Hey, Jay Norvell, hey, uh, quick message to you, man. You did an injustice to your players, man. Total injustice to your players. When you went out and called Deion, well, it ain't even about calling somebody out, man. But when you trash talk and take it, make it personal right there for no reason at all, and you light up an entire team, and you basically lit up the whole country against your team, and your players don't deserve that, man. Now, they actually don't deserve analysts on major networks taking sides, obvious sides. But when they're friends with the head coach, when they're friends with Coach Prime, that is what it is. But you did an injustice to your team. You came out and ran your mouth and disrespected and offended this man. And you're not going, you, you're not taking one snap. You're not going to have to take one hit. You're not going to have to cover one receiver. You're not going to have to tackle one running back. You're not going to have to run into one linebacker. You know how to, you, you're not going to have to do anything. But your players are. And you then made the whole nation against your team, which is not fair to the players on your team. Because if one of them would have said something outlandish like that, probably would have got reprimanded. Because I remember when I was playing that Memphis State football at Memphis State, I said some stuff to gas like the Arkansas Razorbacks. Now I backed it up, but coach wasn't too happy about it. Because normally it's players doing that, not the coaches. But you did that. And don't have to take a snap. And now your players got to feel the brunt of what Colorado is going to try to do to y'all tomorrow. Come on, coach.